Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I got Moonshine Money, Diana Prince, and Glitter Days, The Prophecy. I'm going to do some stamping. I did start with Meltique's Formula 2 as my base coat. And here is Moonshine Manny's Diana Prince. And I put that on my pointer, middle, and pinky. That's where that polish landed. And this Glitter Days went on my thumb and my ring finger, The Prophecy. I just figured let's put these two together and get a chance to wear them. I topped it with Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. I'll be using this Westonia plate called Beach Fun and the Nicole Diary Gold and SO3, my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper, and my Faber Nail Scraper. I'm going to put this image right here with these little like stars on it. I'm going to put those on the blue blue nails, the Diana Prince. And I've got like a little space, so I'm going to try to salvage one more star. Ta-da! We did it! And then I'm going to clean that stamper off on my lint roller. And I'm going to clean the plate off with some acetone. We're going to do this, like I said, on my pointer, middle, and pinky. Well, I didn't say it like that. I said I was going to put it on the blue nails, but they're all blue, so, you know. And I'm just kind of moving that design just a little bit. You know, they don't have to all be exactly the same. Clean that plate off. And then I'm doing this one on the pinky nail, so I don't need, I, mean, I knew I didn't need very much of the image for that little nail. There we go. And I normally pair blue up with silver, but with that accent nail being so light, I just, I just went with gold. No rhyme or reason. So I'm going to put this big image, this other image on my thumb and point, uh, ring finger kind of mimics the other image, but backwards, so, you know, it's, it's all good. I didn't put enough polish on there, but we're, hopefully we can get enough to cover that fingernail. Ta-da, we did. So there we go. I'm going to pop some of this extra polish off with some tape. Just going to go around my finger the best I can and get as much of it up as I can. And this one comes up pretty good with it. You know, it's not perfect, but pretty good, and I'll take that. There we go. Come on, girl. Quit playing around. Let's get this done. Now I'm going to go in with my cleanup brush and some acetone and try to get, you know, a little bit more of that cleaned up. Come on, camera. Act nice. See, there we go. Okay, thank you. So you can see that image. It's, it's, it's a little different. Covers up a lot more of the base polish. So that's just what we went with today. <laughs> Stick around. I'll do something else again. Now that I've got it all cleaned up, we're going to put some Bundle Monster Smudge Free Top Coat over the stamping. We'll seal that in a little bit without smudging it. Of course, you know, the camera's getting all blurry, so it looks like I'm smudging it, but I'm not. Being sure to cap my ends. There we go. And now I'm going to top that with some Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat to seal it all the way in. You know, we've all got our favorite top coats, and, or, you know, I just, I just feel the need to put two top coats on it when I use those smudge-free ones. So here is my swatch photo. I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment down below. Thanks for watching, and until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon.